Yo YouTube, what is going down? It's A. Jones coming out with another video and I'm pretty excited right now. As you can tell, I have LEDs right in front of me and by the title you can tell that I have the RF controller. Now before you go out and buy an RF controller, do not pay over $20. There are people online trying to sell them for $50. It is not a $50 piece. It is. I got mine for $17 I believe. Um, I'll leave a link in the description. Buy it from that seller. This is an awesome product. It's aluminum, it's durable, it has everything that you need. I'm going to walk through everything and how I set it up to have it pulse to sound and I will show you a demonstration in this video. So, um, please be sure to hit that like button because I will go through everything and make this clear as possible. Right here, I bought this 300 LED waterproof um, strip online for $25. Do not pay $25. It is only worth... 22 at max so find it online for $22 or cheaper it comes with the LED strip itself two female plugs on each end um, a power supply unit an IR controller that's just like the 44 key strobe and all like the different settings and that is it now you're gonna have to buy the RF controller and the remote separately which is another $17 so this total cost is like $40 maximum um, what you also need is two auxiliary cables, which is this thing right here. It's this cable, if you guys can see. Here, I'm going to zoom in and focus on this. So it's this cable. It's like the headphone jack. You need a double-sided headphone jack. You need two of those to, the, to make this work. You're also going to need the DC power supply. I believe it's, yeah, DC and power supply. It's like, they are kind of expensive, seven, eight dollars, but they should come with your LED strip. You plug that into the DC in. You can also use power supplies for the cables, but that's too high tech for me, so I'm not using that. You also have on here, let's focus on this right here. You have your mic input on here. I don't know what that is used for. You have your audio input. That's where you're gonna plug in your headphone jack. That's where you're gonna plug in one of your headphone jacks. And then you have a sensitivity. How sensitive do you want this to be to your sound? Oh, oh, the microphone, I'm an idiot. The microphone is actually what picks up if you like don't have anything plugged into audio and you wanna like talk or clap or something. That's what's gonna pick it up to make that sound happen. The audio is if you want a direct audio input, which I do, I have that. So I'm gonna plug that in, have the sensitivity on to what I want it, put this down. On the other side of this, you have your plug. Mine is already pre-put into here. You have your plug in here to go to your cables into here. Now this is easy because it's a connection already. I don't have to worry about, I don't have to worry about like, cutting these wires right here and putting them in here myself which you can do that now on the other side this is what I have for my speakers I have can you guys see that yes I have one of these pieces it's from the airplane that goes one headphone jack into two headphone jacks you want to plug this from your audio source so for my example I'm using my computer I'm gonna plug this into my computer that's gonna take these two cables, the two headphone jacks, one to my RF controller, and the other cable to your actual speakers. This splitter allows you to listen to the music while you see the music happening on here. That is all the connections for this. Now I'm gonna go turn off the lights. I'm gonna show you a demonstration. First off, here's the remote before I get into the demonstration. It has Five sensitivities here. Let's see if we can turn it on. There you go. I I had it on some other thing. So it was on, but it was just like dimly lit. So you have your controller right here. You have all your different white, uh, red, green, blue, and then it has five different like dim settings. So hit it again for a dimmer setting and all the way up to bright. Different colors again. Then you have your flash right here. Yeah, let's focus on the remote. You have the flash right there, um, boom, uh, what is that, bloom, so bloom it just changes colors, smooth, then you have like the music settings right here, I'm not sure what each one does, 
but I will figure that one out while we play the music. Without further ado, I have this connected to my computer. I have it connected to the sound and to the RF controller itself. So what we are going to end up doing is playing music through my computer and it's gonna, we're both going to be able to hear it and see it. Okay, so now I have the lights turned off. I have my remote control right here. I'm going to go through the three settings, the one on the bottom left, the middle, the right one, and then go back to it. Um, once again, playing music through my computer and let's see what this does. Okay, that was the bottom left, and now we're going to go back to the middle. Um, the middle one's right here. I'm going to go and click this one right now. So let's see what that does. Okay, that was the middle one. Now I'm going to go to the right one and see what that does. Okay, that was the bottom right one. Now I'm going to go back to the middle one. As you can tell, the bottom right was pretty boring. Okay, that was the middle one. I think that one's my favorite one so far. Um, I'm going to go back to the bottom left so you can control it. And let's drop that bass. Okay guys, thank you for watching that video. Um, hopefully this was an in-depth, uh, detailed video and it really helped you guys make a decision or just see something that was really cool. Um, please stay tuned to my channel because I do plan on putting this into an infinity mirror table with my buddy and um, having it connected to the music. So that's going to be really interesting. It's going to be a hard project, but uh, please hit that subscribe button. Please hit that like button. And if you guys have any questions or comments, write it in the YouTube comment section below. Or if you want a direct answer, please hit me on my Twitter at a jizzy fo shizzy. It's also in the description below. Once again, thank you guys for watching. Have a good day. Have a good year. And have a good life. Peace out. A jizzy.